So today, I thought I'd show you my morning routine for when I have to be out of the house fast, for meetings, for events, or for travel. I've honed this since university in sixth form. I am a serial late person, so it's important for me to have a routine to combat that. The night before, I pack my bag so I don't have to worry about it the next day. I always make sure there's stuff in there to keep me fresh, especially if it's gonna be a long day. I like to pack an always daily singles to go panty liner. Just like adding a bit of perfume or putting on some lip balm, a liner can keep you feeling fresh for longer, which is good for long days. They're individually wrapped, which is great for when you're on the go. I like to be prepared and make my life a little easier by packing things that help me freshen up on the go. So in the morning, the first thing I do is make breakfast. When I have a busy day, I need to make sure I'm fueled and that my brain is functioning. If I'm running late, I'll have breakfast biscuits or something really easy, but on a normal day, I'll often have something filling but really quick to make, like porridge. I'll use gluten-free oats and almond milk. I don't generally use real milk. Then I add some fruit, like blueberries, and some peanut butter to keep me full. I always have a big glass of water in the morning too, as I dehydrate so much in the night. After I've eaten breakfast, I jump in the shower for a quick wash. I just wash my body and then my face, and I use a clean face cloth to make sure there's no residual makeup or grime from yesterday. Once I'm out of the shower, I clean my teeth and then I moisturise my face with a daily moisturiser. I generally choose one with an SPF in case I forget to add sunscreen later on. Then I go and make myself a coffee. I always need coffee in the morning so I can drink it whilst I do my makeup. Then it's time to get dressed. When I'm getting dressed, I'm focused on comfort whilst also looking put together. So a dress or a jumpsuit is what I usually reach for. Before I get dressed, I can use a daily liner. You can apply the liner in the morning to keep a fresh after shower feeling. They are very comfortable and dermatologically tested too. Always daily liners are super thin and absorb discharge and dampness and odor. So you have the feeling of morning underwear all day, every day of the month. They also have a breathable layer for trusted comfort. Once I'm dressed, I try to make my flat old bed hair a bit nicer. I run a hairbrush through the ends and then spend two minutes or so with the straighteners just to even out the kinks. Then we go to my makeup. This is makeup that takes only a little time but makes me feel very put together for a busy day. So first of all, I take a blending sponge and pop it in my pot of concealer and then take that all around the parts of my face that have redness, which is generally my T-zone area. And then I blend some bronzer onto my cheeks and into the hollows of my cheekbones. I then add just like a blush or a highlighter to bring some dimension back into my face. For brows, I quickly brush through a brow gel that thickens and adds colour whilst also neatening them up. These brow gels last all day, I think they're so good and they're so easy to apply. I then quickly curl my lashes and add mascara. I gently print some on the top of my lashes first and then apply normally from the bottom afterwards. Finally, I'll use a bit of lip balm and a sheer lipstick to bring a bit of colour back into my face. I don't want to be too high maintenance or use like a really matte lipstick, so something sheer or gloss is perfect. Then I put my shoes on, I grab my bag and I'm ready to go. Thank you so much for watching this on the go morning routine. Let me know what your on the go morning routine looks like in the comments because I wonder if they're similar. Do you drink normal milk? We've got so many things to share. And thank you so much to Always for working with me on this video. If you'd like to learn more about the Always Daily Liners, there will be links in the description. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.